Hello everyone, my name is Mapper Young and welcome back to Xenoblade Chronicles X. So, I think we need some progress. We've been, we've been, I, it's been quite a while between chapters. Oh, there's a red thing up there. Let's go get that first. Wait a minute. No, that's that. Okay, we're going to get the red thing, but then we're going to go make some progress. It's just, it's way too easy to get distracted in this game. There's always so much things to do. I'm a little unhappy with our level distribution. So I am like level 28, everyone else is kind of low. But that's okay. I think we, we don't need to be that high level for this. And by me being high level, that will just make it easier to uh, to get through the rest of the run. There's one over there too. But yeah, we need to start the next chapter. Yes. Well. No more distractions. Let's go. <clears throat> I forget. Do I need to have only three people for this? Or can I have uh, someone else along? We'll find out. Okay. Yes, max members three. So let's get rid of Gwyn. And I will stand awkwardly around the table for quite a bit to figure out what the next quest is. Skills are powerless before them. Continuing to persist here is meaningless. It will only serve to thin our ranks. After all this time, we've finally found a clue that may lead us to the Great One. Respect. The phenomenon space surrounding this planet is only 800 exodits in diameter. Three days at light speed is more than enough to scour it thoroughly. If the Great One or the Samar Federation homeland were here, don't you think we would have found something by now? Hmm. It's one thing to engage the enemy all the way out near that forsaken chunk of rock they call Earth. Swallowed up by that strange light and dumped off here in this primordial hellhole? Are we cursed? And trapped with humans of all things. It's like some sick joke. If someone told me this was death, I'd believe them. <laughs> all the more reason to persist. We must retrieve it if we ever hope to escape the confines of this phenomenon. Grandmaster Luxor. Speak. I bring news.
That dude looks kind of brainy. about a pie? That is a great idea! Lindley! Lindley! What is Lindley making? Today is one of my specialties. Hot pie. Pie? Did Tatsu ever tell Lindley pie is his favorite? Tatsu will even help Lindley make it. Great. Why don't you flatten out that crust? Tatsu will jump to it. How big does Lenny want Crest to be? Oh, just big enough. To cover you completely. Yeah! How many times Tatsu need to tell Lindley? Tatsu is here to serve, not me serve! Oh, right. That does sound familiar. Lindley always say that too! Lindley say that every time! Time to eat, everyone! Now that was a meal. I'm impressed, Lynn. My team could learn a thing or two. I'm glad you liked it. But you didn't stop by just for a meal, did you? No. You know me, Elma. It's about a job. It would seem to us the good sir would like to pick our brain. Of course, we will gladly let him in one ear and out the other. Um. Almost, El. Almost that time. An alien mech? What type? No idea. It doesn't match anything on record as far as I can tell. No one's seen anything like it. It looks abandoned too. Totally ripe for the pick. Oh man, you're giving me goosebumps! Right? It's located here. That's pretty deep in Noctilum. No wonder you wanted to talk to El. Exactly. But here's the rub. The Ganglion are after it, too. From what we can tell over Frontier now, they've gone after it several times already. And failed. Well, yes, that doesn't surprise us in the least. That's Tainted Land. Tainted? Doesn't sound fair. They are savage beasts. Ferocious. Insatiable. He's talking about these. We didn't run into anything like that in Noctilum, did we? The Tainted are territorial. They only dwell deep within a specific part of the forest there. Although it doesn't seem right to even call it a forest anymore. Why do you say that? Because the Tainted devour any and all living things, apart from other Tainted, that is. I you mean, even by the Tatsu Maxims? Indeed, you would be swallowed whole. The Tainted would make no bones about you, I'm afraid. Interesting. They must be formidable to be defeating the gang over and over. But if what else says is true, it could work in our favor. Right. Our bodies are artificial moves. If the Tainted don't perceive us as living things, we might be safe. Let's back up a sec. You reported all this to the Commander? Our top priority above all else is Life. Are you suggesting we set that aside to try to recover this life? Exactly. Commander Vandom is why I'm here. Specifically requested I enlist your team. It's just as you say. There's no time for us to screw around. And we still absolutely need to find the life hole. But remember, the fact is we're also dealing with hostile Xenos here. Xenos who destroy the Earth and want every last one of us dead. Xenos, who also seem to want this mech, and desperately. Hmm. And if it's that important to them... Right. What if it's a secret weapon, powerful enough to tip the scales? Feels like a bit of a long shot, to be honest. 
But okay. Even if we can't use it, we should at least keep it from the gangland. Count us in. Any objections? No, ma'am. Glad to hear it. But if we're going to take this on, we'll need to keep it quick. Roger that. Ellen Taxi, you hang back. Unlike us, the tainted will target you guys for sure. Oh, most considerate of you, good sirs. Oh, Lindley! Lindley care about Tuxu after all! Well, of course. After all this time watching over you and fattening you up, I'm not about to let my prize turkey go to some rabid indigens. Head to knock to them and retrieve the alien mech. Everybody set? Yes, sir. Ready to go. So we're going with Lau? excited. Just doing my job. Speaking of which, it's pretty amazing you made White Whale crew at your age. You have family here? My mom and dad passed away. They didn't make it. Ah, uh, that day? The attack on Earth? No, sir. It was before that. An accident. Ah, uh, I'm sorry. It's okay. My parents were both design engineers who worked on the White Whale project. But there was a mishap with the primary engine test. Still, it's thanks to them and people like them that the rest of us are all still here, you know? They made the White Whale space worthy, so they didn't die in vain. At least, that's what I like to think. I see. So they gave you a spot on the White Whale to say thanks. Thanks to your parents for all their hard work. It's a debt I try to repay every day, helping out folks any way I can. Don't misunderstand, Lau. Lynn earned her spot on the crew like anyone else. It was her talent and determination that made it happen. Her parents' positions provided an environment for her learning, but that's it. Lynn got to where she is now, entirely on her own. It's okay, Alma. No, she's right. Sometimes I talk before thinking. Sorry about that. Don't be silly. You don't need to apologize to me, sir. Now, shall we get going? Okay. He's he's even lower level. Okay. And the problem with Lao is that his armor sucks. He's got a uh, skill armor. Right? Yeah, so it has minus five resistance to everything, except that uh, it gives him extra bonuses when using a skill, but we don't have skills. So, oh well. I kind of don't want to bother to replace it now. I want to wait till people are leveled up more and then just get good armor all at the end. Not the end, but at some point we'll really commit to getting some good armor. Not yet. Anyway, so they want us to go and knock to them. No point going back outside. It's in an area we haven't been to yet. To the northeast. Well, we'll see how we get there. We covered the the west side knocked them pretty well now. Yeah. But there's still some areas on the east and the far north that we haven't touched. Follow ball, tell me where to go. Okay. Uh, I forget. I'm a backstab person. So. Level 23s are a little low for me. I kind of would rather just go around. What's this weather? It is clear. It doesn't look clear. We've 
explored this area before. I guess we just never, uh... It, it's not sending me the right direction. I should be going off to the northeast, and instead it's... Oh, southeast now. Instead it's sending me up here. Hmm. Is this a bay? Across here? I guess not. Oh, okay. Which way? If we go straight, we should hit some caves that lead to our destination. Ah. Well, what's to the right? <laughs> okay, then. Let's go. We'll come back and explore, I guess. We'll explore a bit right now. And then go back. Another spherical EM motor. Awesome. Oh, I remember this. We have been here. We uh, couldn't go up there yet. Okay. Yeah, this is where we got our first spherical EM motor. Okay, never mind. We gotta step up. Okay. Follow the cliffs and you'll pass through a pattern into a cavern into Dead Man's Gulch. Those are totally enemies right there. Okay. Okay. There you are. Ah, uh, this could be a problem. I'll take it. Come on, get it. Arcing A lot of AOE damage, that's a problem. Five Don't look at me. When I hit, I okay. some heals here. Ah, they keep hopping around, it's annoying. There we go. <coughs> Maybe not. Okay, good. Good enough. Oh my. Strength comes from experience. That's true on any front. We do have weather now. It is energy mist, which is bonus potential, I think. There's more of these. So we, we better be careful and just take them out as we get them. Otherwise, we'll um, end up getting lots of them at once. One on one, they're pretty easy, but with like five of them, that would be a problem. There we go. They're not even good XP. Uh, can we get past that one, maybe? Nope. We've got the first one! Fire! 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 Fire!
I just aggroed another one. I just missed the soul voice. How annoying. Now I'm getting somewhere. Okay. Well, at least we're helping them get caught up. There's another couple. Ah, uh, it's morning now. Maybe they're not gonna be hostile anymore? They're gonna be hostile. close to uh, finishing up this class and we'll need to decide where we're, where we're, where we're going to go next. Probably after this chapter. We'll, we'll just finish this chapter. Um, no. No, that's not happening. Don't kill me, please. I don't want to have to clear all that again. Weather. There we go. Uh, wh where did those Atsekulas come from? Are those their papples? Interesting. I thought they were Atsekulas. But I think they're floating fish, not insects. Maybe they're insects. I don't know. But yeah, um, disguised high-level tyrant. Scary things. Yeah, it's, it's clearly a, one of those ugly bug things. Don't attack me, don't attack me, don't attack me, good. False Thallus. Well, let's take it. Let's get on with it. Let's get up close in person. Okay, I'm getting a I owe you one. Thanks. Give me some of this one. Shot him. Lay down that cover fire. I'm just getting my uh I'm I'm I'm, I'm, I'm never attacking from the right spot. <laughs> there we go. We got him. Let's move. Yeah, getting one of those, um, uh, uh, a double cooldown uh, TP abilities. Uh, oh, that's, that's a Thallus right there. That's totally a Thallus. Of course, hey, but if you insist. Thanks for the advice. Arching force. Yeah, one of those, um, like I said, one of those high TP abilities all cool down and can really just end the fight. It does like half their damage and one ability. Half their HP. this strong when I needed to be. What's a blade medal? Blade medal is obtained? I know I have these reward tickets, but what's a blade medal? Uh, any thaluses? No. What are these? They look. They look like they're things. Oh well.
This means we're getting close. Yeah, it's just ahead. Uh, Elma? Relax. They won't bother us if we don't bother them. Yeah, I know what you mean, but... <sighs> They're awfully big. They're only level 23, though. Tainted Caro. Well, Shadow Strike. We've got the first strike. Take it. My forte. Shadow Strike. Shield Strike. Appreciate it. Do some damage. Sliding Slinger. Sliding Slinger. Decent HP pulls. Balance Breaker. I always love enemies you can where you can uh, hit the tail. When I hit. I Cut off the tail. Nice. Eight thousand hits. Eight thousand damage in one hit. I forgot to see how much XP that was. <laughs> the point of that was to figure it out whether they are worth killing, and I didn't know. Well, we'll try killing another one. Tail. Tail first. Okay. Where are you? Where is your back? There it is. Okay. Shadow strike! Backslash! Side one! Side one! Side one! Side one! When I hit, I hit the car. Archie pull! Melee attack! I'm at four, Jay, but if you insist... Blood in Slinger! XP? A hundred for me, even though it's well under my level. Class rank up, I got new skill. Well, I don't want to sit and grind on them, but we'll at least not shy away from getting these uh, archaeology things. Although it's kind of weird to call that archaeology when clearly these were like just destroyed like last week. Or whatever. We saw the movie. <laughs> Curious music. Ooh, those are more problems. That looks like a, a, a Dua Gil? It won't lock onto it. do this. There. It's a uh, Sintimer. Skintimer. Oh well, it's not high level though, so we can deal with that probably. Unexplored territory discovered. Millstone Ridge. Ah. Uh, okay. That's the thing. No signs of any radiation. Infrared, motion sensors, <clears throat> I got nothing. This thing's dead as a doornail. Oh man! So it's basically a skill, right? 
But the make is nothing like ours. Or the Ganglions. Where could it be from? Oh, wow! I can't even tell what its armor is made of! What is this feeling? It's... oppressive. It's pulsing off of this thing. It's almost as if... the ghost of its pilot is somehow still lingering. No, that's just being overly dramatic. And that material there, at its core... It's... dark matter. Uh-huh. This must be their handiwork. Uh, I, I, I want to know what she's talking about. Hmm? No, no idea. Liar. All right, well, we got what we came here for. Let's call in the salvage choppers and get it out of here. Lynn, contact Commander Vandom. On it. Holding it up with force fields? Tractor beams? Right. We should okay. start heading back too. Mm, just thinking about walking past all those tainted again makes my knees all wobbly. Tatsu have just the thing! Friends fuel up with Tatsu tasty lunch box! <laughs> Tatsu? What are you doing here? Tatsu knew friends must be hungry, so Tatsu rides spinny plane here to deliver hot meal. Tatsu hero pond, after all. Oh, you idiots! You're gonna attract the tainted! Relax, Linley. After quick lunch, Tatsu fly back home on spinny plane before anyone notice. And how exactly do you plan to do that? All the spinny planes have already left. You're gonna have to walk back through all those tainted! We'll last ten seconds out here! Huh? Maybe we can get another chopper here in time. Too late. <laughs> Looks like somebody else wants a hot meal. Tatsu, don't move an inch, you hear? <laughs> it's cool, we can take him. Get the tails first. It's all the tails. They're off guard. I can stop them. Fire the hole. Archie Bull. Lay down to cover fire. Shut up, Spike. Let's go. Sit in dark. Appreciate it. There's one tail. First down. Getting the side. These guys stand weird or something. Because I don't seem to have trouble getting behind them. That's one down. Fire will hold! They got some cover fire! Look at this sitting dumb! Executioner! Now we're busy! Take me a cut! My force, eh? But if you insist! Time to run Wow, they just wrecked loud.
is all your fault, Tatsu. Oh my. Oh, we've seen one of those before. There was like a level 70 of them. That was an oblivion. Take him down. Oh my. Tainted Sphinx. I want to get that on a call. Wow, that died real quick. Come on, give me a call. Kill me. Wow, we're getting wrecked. Move in and do some damage. That's what I was waiting for. Oh my, what just happened? Ah, uh, it keeps on hopping around. Annoying. Really? You got Lao up? He's just gonna die again. We have ads. Oh, great. This guy's almost done. We didn't get his tail yet. <laughs> That was really a lot of XP. Well, that was fun. Let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> <laughs> that was a great reaction, though. You've got to be kidding me. This is not going to go well. What the hell is that?
sequence. Was that thing trying to help us? Maybe. Or maybe it was just toying with us. Well, I think I could have taken it. <laughs> we should get back to New L.A. I want to stop by the hangar and get a better look at that scalp. Right. I wish I was this strong when I needed to be. Okay. It's a thunderstorm now, which reduces ranged accuracy. I don't know what the middle thing is. Well, let's look around here more. Just make sure we have this place cleared. I think we're good. I don't see any of the yellow things on the map. Okay, let's just get out of here then. Uh, we'll warp back to New LA. Uh, well, now we'll keep our marine. So we want to go to the hangar district. Or the administrative district, the restricted hangar. Okay, this is right next to where Doug is. Oh, there's Vandom. Good work, people. Commander? What are you doing out here? Did they seal off the area? Actually, I was waiting for you, Lynn. Hmm? Why me? You want to tinker with that new alien mech? Well, I mean, duh. Good, because I'm putting you in charge of research. You help reel it in, you get first crack at it. You and your team risked a lot out there. You earned it. Really, sir? That seems just. Everything's set up. They're expecting you. Yes, sir! Oh my god, thank you so much, Commander! even a skell? I mean, the external armor maybe, but I'm not detecting any known materials or components for the purple frame part. In fact, I can't even find a power source. Maybe it's like an idol or something? To some alien god or whatever? What about a cockpit? Or any space for a pilot? Let's see here. There is a cavity in the middle of the chest area. If this thing is a vehicle, that'd have to be the cockpit. Hmm. Perhaps it's not a weapon? It was abandoned after all, and in that godforsaken place. But it was also worth the ganglion sacrificing all those soldiers to try and recover it. Surely it must hold some value. Granted. Now the question is whether we'll be able to uncover it. Ms. Ku is one of our best, but we can't expect her to work miracles. If you ask me, that's time better spent studying that Ares of yours, Elma. Mm -hmm. All right, you wouldn't know what I'm talking about, would you? Let me explain. The Ares is what Elma... Vandom. Oh, uh, right. So many secrets. Sea Tech Astronomy. The 
Those are your orders. Have I made myself clear? Quite. You seem displeased, Gajarg. Ah, cat people. Perhaps the great hero of Roth does not enjoy taking orders from the ganglion. Perhaps he feels it beneath him. It appears nothing is beneath me of late. Lewd. I still hear the anger in your voice, the way you spit out the words. Accept your fate. Then you might find me a more accommodating master, Prince Jarg. Oh, but how rude of me. Should I have said, former prince? I never cared much for titles. Counselor Luxar. It's Grand Master, damn you! The entire Ganglion organization is at my command, as are you and your people. I will not remind you again. Oh, but how rude of me. My sincere apologies, Grand Counselor. Hmm. Have you also forgotten the price the Rothian people will pay if you fail me? I promise you, it will not be pretty. What will happen if the humans beat you to the prize? Hmm? Need I remind you of that as well? No, you need not. Then mind your tongue, former prince. Unless your pride can feed and clothe your people. Filthy cur. Yet I will suffer him gladly. If he can help lead me to you, oh great one. Chapter 6 complete. You successfully retrieved the alien mech. However, with so many unknowns, the investigation looks to be tough going. Getting a skill license. We hear you're shaping up to be quite the operative. Well then, you think you got what it takes to be skill worthy? See me when you're ready to go for your license. I'll be waiting. Okay, I'm gonna take a break there. That was a very heavy exposition episode. Now we can now we can go around wasting our time doing like side quests and things, probably. So thank you everybody for watching. My name is Michael Young. This is Xenoblade Chronicles X.